Hey everybody, it's your boy Kool-Aid. Uh, we're up back here in Hardcore 83's world. Uh, we're going to run through and do a quick fly-through tour of a couple of his buildings here, some of his games that he has in progress, some of the games that he's finished, that, and uh, at least one game that somebody else built in his world that we couldn't really go in and do. Um, he didn't want to put it out there since it's somebody, else, you know, somebody else's creation, but the uh, building that we're looking at is actually a parkour setup almost like a parkour complex there on the left you can see it's a it's a race four different or four of the identical courses with lava after he finishes this it is a work in progress right now but once he finishes it it'll have lava all the way across so if you fall off you die uh, inside is another parkour course now I'm not super awesome at parkour so I haven't really done it that much but it'll be interesting once he finishes all this stuff to come in here again and, and visit him again and go through and see how I fare at that. <laughs> it won't be very well. Um, over here, that's the bowling game. Uh, there in the distance, you can see that's the game we won't really look at, but it is amazing the way it works. Uh, this is the rock, paper, scissors that we went to in the last, <clears throat> last video. Excuse me. This game is Mastermind. I wanted to go in and try it out and see if we could play it, but it wasn't reset, so there was lava on both sides. It was very dangerous, uh, <laughs> dangerous to look at, so we didn't go in there. This is a soul sand hurdles. Basically, you got patches of soul sand along these running routes to slow you down. So if you don't make the jump, you slow down even more. And it makes it harder to win. And once he puts ice underneath those soul patch, soul sand patches, it'll slow him down even more. So we did run it a couple of times. It's really fun. And once again, it's things like that where it doesn't even use redstone. It's just you take elements and things that are in the game just naturally and and create these things. And it's just like the real world where people take things of everyday parts of the world and they and they create, you know, machines and stuff like that. So to see that kind of ingenuity out here, it just it always amazes me. I know I say that way too much, but it's true. You know, and, and that's one of the things I love about the community of, around Minecraft. Uh, this game was a lot of fun. It reminds me of Break the Ice. Basically, you all run around with shovels and you knock these blocks out from under each other. And there's three levels. And the one that falls down to the bottom level and dies, obviously, that's the loser. So, um, we're back over here at the main building. Uh... We had a lot of fun touring this world and, and, and just giving me a chance to see the things that he's creating. I love the way everything fits together. Uh, we did, now back there there was a high, jump, um, high dive. Uh, we did it off camera, it was it was fun. Um, and that's one of the things I want to talk about real quick. When people make things out here and they, you know, that's one of the reasons I'm doing this series and, and, and hitting up game facts. Which shout out to GameFacts.com, but one of the reasons I want to do this series is to get more people showing the creations they're coming up with. Uh, we all look at, you know, redstone, and we and we get totally different ideas in our mind of what that redstone can do, or we look at the the way TNT drops, and you know, we start analyzing like, oh, how can we use that in some way, or uh, sandstone slowing people down and creating a race course out of it. I mean everybody is able to come up with these different ideas and I want to show as many of those ideas as possible I want to use your ideas to create to put a skew on them and, and create my own ideas and have you see ideas that I've come up with or that other people come up with and putting your skew on it and let's just keep building this community I mean PC has it they've had it for years now and I can see where it's really picked up a lot and, and people are doing huge things on Xbox and as we get more updates and more new things to use at our disposal it'll be fun for us to continue to build this this spirit of community so that we can share ideas and create better and better and better and that's really exciting to me so if you're on game facts and you're here watching this send me a message uh, if you're on YouTube subscribe click like if you like the video if you didn't like the video click like anyway and send me comments uh, put comments out here send me messages you know link up with me I'll, I'll add you to my friends list we'll come out we'll tour your world see what you got going on and uh, hopefully we can build an even better experience for everybody 
So anyway, peace out you guys. I love you all. And hopefully we'll see you soon in your world.